Yo guys, it's Ace and welcome back to another player review video on my channel today. We're going to review Ricardo Quaresma, the Portuguese winger from Besiktas. And if you guys do want to see another player review from this week's Team of the Week, someone like Kostic, which I was thinking about doing, make sure to drop a comment of which player you want me to do. Uh, make sure you have liked the video and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. I'm going to go in and show you the in-game stats on this player before we go and show you some clips. Right guys, so here is Ricardo Quaresma's in-game stats. We've got um, 93 crossing, we've got 95 agility, we've got 87 balance. Um, his finishing is not the best, obviously, at 73. He's got quite a bit of pace, um, and his stamina is a bit of a letdown as well. But there are his in-game stats. I'm going to go show you some clips of what I got with him in-game. Right guys, so I'm going to show you all the clips and the goals I got in the background But before I start telling you all the pros and cons If you guys are looking to play some competitive FIFA This is probably not the sort of card you want to use Because this one's pretty, it's like a, a fun card you'd use in FIFA Because of the 5 star skills and the dribbling um, He has got decent finishing as you can see there But there is a lot of people in like FIFA that do like a bit of um, the, skill, the skill base of the game So if you are that sort of player this card is probably for you But we're going to go into some pros now before um, the like we get to the cons really um, so some of the pros we got here is his pace is pretty good his dribbling and agility is probably the most fun thing about his card apart from the 5 star skills obviously because if you can pull them off you're having a great time um, here is his agility and skills as I just said winning a nice penalty there which we do slot away in the bottom corner very nicely I thought this guy was actually going to rage quit but um, another pro would be probably his, oh he's got good long shots but his finishing inside the box isn't the greatest, sometimes he'd miss some shots which I'd probably expect him to score, um, some one on ones he did miss which you'll see in a little while, um, he's got nice low drivens um, which I score a couple with them, but um, that's pretty much it for the pros um, and uh, if I haven't said already his crossing's really good as well, I did try and do some Rabona crosses to score with Andre Silva but he wasn't, Andre Silva was pretty terrible. But there's a nice little skill move there. I did show a couple. This is the one I missed here, which I think I should have scored. But they're all the pros for him. Um, some of the cons we got for this guy. Um, we've got heading and jumping is terrible. Uh, he he's not very good at jumping, and he never. I don't think he even headed a ball once in these four games I played with him. Um, obviously, a weakness for this card is his. Well, his nation isn't terrible, but there's not that many great Portuguese players in the game, and obviously he's in the Turkish league with Besiktas. Um, this card did cost 60,000 coins and currently in the market it is 70,000 coins but um, it will drop uh, once the uh, foot champions rewards come out uh, but this is one of the last goals I do score here um, I actually think I lost this game pretty badly but uh, this is one of the, the sort of long shots I guess it's not really a long shot but it's outside the box anyway that kind of counts but yeah that was a nice little goal. This game was really laggy, as you can see. It was horrendous. I actually messaged this guy to see if we could uh, change that. Right, guys, so here are the stats I got with Ricardo Quaresma. I got four games played, five goals and one assist. Would I recommend this card? Um, I'd only recommend this card if you're looking to do the fun factor in FIFA, so just play for a laugh and have fun. I wouldn't use it in foot champs personally, but if you do, good luck with that. Um, if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already. That would be much appreciated. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.